This is Ground Affected. My name is Brent and welcome to your wife finding the receipt for your latest 3D printer. And in this video, we're gonna talk about updated fruit bowls. Now for real, we're gonna talk about the new update in lychee. There is a couple things I definitely need to show you. They definitely stepped up the game with this new update. So first off, one of the main things that for me I immediately noticed was that the print history the thing that kept asking you if your last print was okay, even if you turned it off, that always popped up in the center of your screen was the most annoying thing I'd ever known in my life. I always had to click it off, close the window, and then another one would pop up, then I'd have to close that one. It always happened twice, and I needed to do that every time I wanted to support something. Drove me up the wall, they've moved it away. It's now up in the top corner, so even if it shows it to me, I don't even have to care. It's just out the way. It's not in my face. Very good feature. This one, I like. This, I like. If I want to get rid, I can click and it's, it doesn't bother me. Thank you, Lychee. That is the best update you've ever done. Genuinely, it's the dumbest little thing, but it honestly, it makes the world for me. Now, usually when I'm supporting something, I go through a certain work flow and essentially I do a couple of things that I need to do in order to get the piece supported it's usually autopilot because supporting it's not really the funnest of things to do and I know a lot of people have problems with this and are very intimidated by this however lychee makes this so much easier for you when I started out one of the main things was not knowing where the islands were and this is one of the things lychee does extremely well to show you where the islands are and make everything super easy in a super simple interface and they have now updated that interface it looks slightly different but it is super super easy to use once I've got the part that I need to support ready and orientated in the direction everything is ready to go the next thing I'm gonna do is move over into the preparation tab and if you've used lychee before you'll notice a couple of changes in this tab namely the area around your supports they've actually got a little picture now it looks really cool everything looks super super professional so i have set my own custom supports and i believe that supports are something that are personal but you can use others as a baseline and kind of build your own from there so one of the really cool things about lychee is the island detector and once you click the island detector it is going to start to search for the islands on the model this is something that i find is a really really great feature in fact if i never had this in the beginning i would not be able to support models at all this is a super, super easy and awesome feature that Lychee implemented long, long, long time ago. And I've been using this. It still works perfectly great. This is one of the best features you can have. Great. So once the app has found all the islands, usually this is the point where you forget that you haven't lifted the model off the build plate yet, which is a problem because, of course, you need to support that bottom corner. So over here, you go to utilities, you lift it up by five millimeters and it will lift it up for you. It will not calculate that last island though, unfortunately, the island that was touching the build plate, but it's pretty easy to find that one. But if you really can't find it, you can just hit search for islands again and it will look for it. Another really cool feature in Lychee is that you can, once you've made sure your anchors are good, in this case, I haven't completely made sure everything's good. I'm just trying to run through things with you and just give you a brief overview without being too long and boring of a video. So what you can do is click this little button in the bottom here that says add all supports to the islands. What will happen is Lychee will automatically add supports to all the islands that it can possibly add it to. This will then just give you a very general basic support structure, which has started by Lychee just by adding supports to all the islands. You can then go through, for example, we know that this little piece here right at the bottom of the whole entire section is definitely not going to be held by one tiny support. Neither are these sections here, but that's okay. I would go through in the beginning and put all my anchor supports in first and then if there's a bunch of supports that I just really can't be asked to go through and find where they all are, I'll just click that add supports and it will just add them to it for me. I can then go through and add additional supports that are needed if needed. Now one of the main reasons that I wanted to show you an update for Lychee this time is because they've added something that is totally going to change the way we view and use Lychee. This feature is called painting supports. And essentially what's going to happen is instead of going along and clicking one at a time at a time at a time now what you can do is just click once 
hold that button down and paint your supports on. This is going to save so much time. Check this out. That is that entire place supported. Now you can change the distance between these. You can also use a tablet and the tablet is pressure sensitive, which you can adjust to do different spaces between the supports or you can adjust it to do heavier or lighter supports according to the pressure you use on the tablet this is game changing 100 percent. this is going to change a game for a lot of people now i definitely do need to work on the distancing between my supports however this is still going to make supporting so 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 much easier for this entire piece at the bottom here i've basically supported it just by running my mouse around just like this all you have to do is literally just run your mouse around in the place that you want the supports to be job done those supports are perfect i mean it's not perfect but there is plenty of support at the bottom of this model and it took me so much less time than what it would have taken had i have done this one support at a time so as you can see just running up the side of this piece like this is super quick and easy to add the supports where i need them to be i don't have to sit here and place them all one by one i can literally just place them in like i'm painting them in this is amazing this genuinely look at how quickly that was that was super 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 quick granted there is a lot of supports in this situation i wouldn't use this many but i'm gonna adjust some of the settings a little bit just to make sure that it all works out great but this is genuinely a game changer for me this is going to speed things up so so much for me so this was just a video just to kind of show you the new updates on lychee if you would like to update your lychee then i will leave a link in the description for you to be able to do that yourself as well of course i'd like to thank my patrons for the support they give me and also to help keep these lights blind in my eyeballs even while i'm trying to look at the computer now that we're at the end of the video i'd like to ask you to like and subscribe because for every one more subscriber i get i will have one more subscriber and also if you didn't like anything you saw in the video then the best thing you can do for yourself is to just fuck off but please click the dislike button because i need that interaction thank you for coming